I'm at the bus stop. Yeah. I'm not catching the bus. I'm actually catching an Uber. heading over to work it was a long day yesterday I finished up I'm here today and I got uh, three jobs today I'm gonna go to let's see my first job is in Frisco Texas I did the estimate yesterday for it I finished that up so I'm gonna go pick I think it's the next right actually and uh, my, my second job is actually going to Dallas I'm gonna pick up some uh, crates uh, at a home in Dallas, uh, the, the lady apparently has ordered some furniture and she didn't know how to get rid of the crates, so I'm picking that up today. I'll see you on in a few minutes. I'm getting in one of my trucks and bye. Hey, bro. Anyway, guys, um, all right, so Johnny's back in the truck right now. Say, what's up, Jay? What's going on? And we're heading out to uh, Mockingbird, uh, a little of the Highland Park SMU area. We're going to pick up a crate that has trash in it or listen it's just a crate i think it's just wood to be honest with you we're gonna go check it out right now i called the lady she wasn't answering but we'll still go right yeah so it's close by usually we call to verify if if it's far and we call and you don't answer we don't go but we call she's not answering but we're still gonna go regardless so we're gonna eat some breakfast he got some tacos at tacos are us we're out of here okay To a house here it's a really nice neighborhood you know these houses are more historic than anything you can take a look at them except that one <laughs> um the alley we're going back there right now usually these alleys are pretty small so we're hoping the truck fits in there I'm heading to the hollow house what is this the courthouse what is this mess I need that for the tarp his LeBron James skills here we're here just wood that's it. So we got some wood. It's right here. It's not bad. All right, we're here. We just started loading this. You know, I think yesterday she mentioned it was only two, uh, two boxes, but there's a lot more than two. What's up? What's up? I'm back, and um, we just showed up to Frisco, Texas. Um, before this, I had arrived at. Um, I went and gave an estimate in, in Frisco, right? So I gave the estimate in Frisco, and it was a for, a for it was for a lot of fiberglass. So today, we are ready to do the fiberglass. Uh, Johnny's here with us, and we stopped to get some gloves. That's one of the most important things is to have gloves. Johnny, tell him. Yeah, fire glass and hold on to it. Yeah, all day and night. Especially at night when you're sleeping, right? It's evil. 
So anyway, we got to clean out about four of these uh, units. It's actually three units. That's what I gave the uh, estimate for. But I'm going to find a place so I can drop this dumpster so we can do it better, right? I think most of it's going to come out of these two. There's not much on the last one. So I'll drop the dumpster right here. Uh, this shopping center right there. Remember that thing yes, the other day? I don't know what they do there. There ain't nobody renting from there. So, uh, huh? Yeah, see if it's open. I didn't lock it. You want to start dragging it out? Grab the door. Probably this is the biggest one right here. Put something on the door. All right, so all the fiberglass is in there. We're going to start pulling that out. I'm going to drop this dumpster. So that's why it's easier for us just to walk it in. So here's a secret. If you want to drop it off, there's nobody around, you unhook it right here. All right, and then you push it. it sometimes makes a loud noise like that. Let's do a little Q&A on this thing. Teach you a little FYI for your info on this. Whenever you have fiberglass, I always tell everybody, use gloves. And I always recommend using long sleeves. Like, not this. I forgot. Hey guys, so I just talked to the owner of the shopping center. I just got off the phone with her. And uh, she's actually the management team for it. And she said they have a dumpster and it's sitting right there. Y'all can see it from here. Um, <coughs> that we can throw some of the fiberglass in there. So it's not that bad. So we save her some money. We don't have to overcharge her. If we come back out again, I have to charge her. What we're doing is we're gonna dump some of this stuff into the other dumpster. Wow, this stuff is really bad for you. I have it all over me. here we just finished in frisco we took a bath at racetrack the girl even popped some attitude off to me um she got mad because i was taking a bath in the sink well, well i can see her point i was in the sink in front of customers and stuff but the place is empty isn't it there's nobody in the place anyway i'm gonna call it a day today guys i'm going home i hope you enjoyed the uh, video today so what did we overall overall what did we do uh we went 
to the lady's house in Highland Park. We removed the pieces of wood. Uh, we got those pieces of wood, put them in another truck, and then we came to Frisco for the second job. And out here in Frisco, we cleaned out three buildings, all full of fiberglass and we're itchy. It's hazardous stuff. We still did it. I got glass in between my nose right here. Hell, I thought you didn't watch it, but... Anyway, Johnny went in the restroom and took a bath. I stayed outside and just, you know, bathed myself. If you get a chance, over there to your right side, click and subscribe. And on your other side, do not forget to check out my other videos. I will see you on mañana. We gotta work again, guys. We're working every day. See y'all later. Okay.